What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Nocturne Rebirth. <clears throat> Obviously, I'm making this a montage today. I'm just, I'm just going, getting, I'm cranking out, just cranking out some Nocturne. I gotta do it. Gotta get this game. Gotta want it. I want it. I need it. Give me some. Oh yeah, Reviel's back. He's not. He's not. He refuses to lay in the bed. Look at that. He's up. He's like, I'm up. Let's do it. He'll eat the food though, he was like, yeah. I'm glad to see that you enjoyed breakfast as always. By the way, Revio, did you say anything strange to Luna last night? For some reason, that girl looked unusually in high spirits earlier this morning. I was wondering if you have any idea about it. No, not that I know of. Is that so? Well. That girl tends to go out of control at times, after all. Oh, speaking of which, try not to tease her too much, okay? She's the type who takes things too seriously. One could say she's also a rather rigid person. If only she can just lighten up a little. Yeah. Oh, just one more thing. Luna said she would like you to come to Mr. Rosh's place after you had your breakfast. Rush, Rosh. Sorry about this, but is it okay if you can head there now? Alright, I'll be on my way. Okay! This Ross is right here, right? I'm here. What do you need from me? Oh, Mr. Reviel. Well, um... Luna? You're putting Reviel on the spot. It's not really a big deal at any rate, so speak up. You're right. Um, I have a special favor to ask of you. Aw, oh, snap. What's the meaning of this? Please, let me challenge you to a fight. Oh, shit. Take this as a request from me, yeah? Think of it as some small exercise. I won't be useful as a reference, all right? Yes! As expected of Mr. Reviel, is this all that you've got? <laughs> we'll use up on it for now. I guess it can be helped. Satisfied. Uh, ouch. As one would expect of you, Mr. Reviel. I'm simply no match for you. Well, at least I got to kill time. He's a lot stronger than I thought. See? What did I tell you? Ha! My, my hand still hurts. I could tell that he wasn't even taking the fight seriously. He could possibly even defeat my grandfather. He's not human, isn't he? He's not human, is he? That's what it should say. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. What makes you say that? I just know. I was once a vampire slayer, after all. Uh, really? I was at the foot of the table, though. I wasn't even on par with Edith or any other of this... Either, any other one of the seven swordsmen. But I could tell that he's not human. He's a devil, and a high class one at that. Mr. Raviel is. I believe nobody else knows his true identity. Since you have trust in, in him, I won't reveal his identity to anyone. Huh? Anyway, I have things that I need to settle before noon. Sorry, but I'll have to excuse myself here. Mr. Rush. Uh. Uh. As I thought, that fight felt like I was merely playing around. Guess I can't expect more than that from a human, can I? Well, no matter. 
I should head to the Chaos Residence. I have a few things to talk to him about. Alright, let's do it. Man, I want... I want Luna! She can heal us, Reviel. Alright. New items will be arriving soon. Look forward to it! Ooh, I do look forward to it. Alright, bye. I don't know what some of some familiar is. But I don't know. Way stronger. Oh man. Oh yeah. Now that is a familiar. Revia has so much experience, like I could really just deck him out right now and make a monster, but I can't. I've been playing this game for 10 hours, holy crap. Alright. I don't know what the next Brave Clear is, so I don't want to level up yet. Alright. I guess we'll just go to the residence. Welcome, Mr. Reviel. You. Is there something that you need from me? No. I've always thought how rare it was in chaos to have created a familiar. But I didn't imagine you would be a familiar with self-consciousness. You sure are a well-made familiar. Take it as a compliment. I am well made because I am a substitute. Chaos is making tea! Welcome, Reviel. Did you enjoy yourself back there? No, oh, I'm changing his voice again. There I go. Yeah, in fact, it was more enjoyable than I imagined. Ristil certainly has evolved compared to the last time I faced her. Maxwell is originally a familiar that controls the dead, but the monsters that I fought back in that cave were actually living monsters controlled by Maxwell, and it would appear that they were just experimental beings. As one would expect of you, Reviel, you were able to figure out so much that, so much in your encounter with those monsters alone. Did those monsters exist partly due to your powers, Chaos? Not at all. If anything, it only gave her a word of warning. Maxwell and the, and the deep fountain of power it possesses are both powers unique to her. Besides, I can't possibly emulate you. That may be true, but who knows? After all, one who isn't a match for, any, for another may resort to backhanded means. Well, I don't mind that as long as it's entertaining. But wouldn't you agree that using backhanded means is something only weaklings would use? Oh, I wonder about that. Well, no matter. We're still somewhere in this forest, right? In that case, there's still a chance that I'll meet her sooner or later. I'll learn the whole truth when that time comes. Yes, you're certainly right about that. Uh, I'll see you then. It was a nice change of pace for me, by the way. And I'll have to thank you for that. Say... Do you mind helping me with something? Help you with something? Now that's rare coming from you. What is it? 
There's a small clearing just west of here, and southwest of the village of Algiz, known as Fio's Tree Ruins. I would like you to place this licorice mirror there. Licorice? Licorice mirror? Licorice? Licorice? What is it for? Why can't I say the word? It's a magical tool used as a medium to create the territorial barrier here. Fio's Tree Ruins is a place with great flow of mana. I'm thinking of opening up a new path there. Fine. <laughs> Licorice smear kit! Alright, alright. I'll be back then. Alright. Be safe, Reviel. I'm counting on you. Theo's tree ruins. That's the place where that vampire slayer tried to ambush me. Do I remember? This forest is filled to the brim with strong aura of killing intent. You must not let your guard down. So tell me the village of Algae so I can go to the village of Algae. Forest of Origins? There's the village. And there's the forest. Alright. 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 I'm gonna end this episode here. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, you know I'm gonna make another one. Uh, but yeah. Uh, hit like. Subscribe. The bell. Bloody skip. All that stuff they make me say. And uh, hope you're having a good day. And I'll see you when I make another one.